So, in second year MBBS, we have four main subjects, namely forensic, pathology, pharmacology, and microbiology. In this video, we are going to discuss what are the standard books for these subjects, what are the books I have followed, and what are the highlights of the books. So, before going into the video, hi guys, this is Dr. Venkatesh Kartikeyan, Community and Family Medicine Resident from Ames Patna. So, let's go straight into the video. Coming to Forensic Medicine and Toxicology, uh, Essentials of Forensic Medicine and Toxicology by Narayan Reddy is commonly used by students across the country, but I found it, it is too elaborate. So, I opted for a book named Synopsis of Forensic Medicine and Toxicology by the same author, Narayan Reddy. It's simple, concise and high yielding one. With such a small book, I managed to get distinction in my final examination. So, I would strongly recommend everyone to buy Synopsis of Forensic Medicine and Toxicology by Narayan Reddy. So, secondly, uh, discussing the books for pathology, Robinson Cotrans is the gold standard book for pathology which is accepted worldwide. It was such an interesting book to read with uh, things explained in such a beautiful manner. So, this is definitely a must-have book. Harsh Morgan book is another uh, famous and commonly used by students across India. Though it is so much popular, I did not find it fascinating and convincing to use that book. So I leave it upon your decision. Maybe you can read the same topic on different uh, different books and find out which book is suitable for you. Despite things that are so beautifully described in Robbins, towards the end of my second year, I got the fear that I may not be able to reproduce things uh, in a better way if I am reading Robbins. So I took the help of Exam Preparatory Manual by Ram Das Naik. Such an awesome book with beautiful diagrams and a wonderful orientation and alignment. Uh, if I have come across this Ram Das Naik book earlier, I would have definitely opted it over Robbins. So again, I leave it to your decision of choosing which book you need to study for pathology. Coming to microbiology, textbook of microbiology by Ananta Narayan and Panika is commonly used by students in our nation. Though I was not much comfortable with it, I stick to that book because I did not find an alternate option. So, and uh, Paniker is good for parasitology as well. Coming to pharmacology, Goodman and Gilman is the gold standard book which is used across the world. In India, pharmacology book by K.D. Tripathi is much widely used and it's a pretty decent book. Uh, also, I would recommend everyone to buy drug classification book by the same author K.D. Tripathi. But these two books alone, I was able to manage uh, distinction in pharmacology. So, uh, K.D. Tripathi, the main book and the drug classification book is more than enough to score well in your examination as well as to understand the basics of pharmacology. Coming to practicals, for all these four subjects, uh, in my college they gave me a practical manual for these subjects. If you are not given one in your college, actively ask for help from your seniors. It is essential to collect all the materials needed for your practical examinations beforehand right at the beginning of the year. It is also essential to start getting familiar with history taking and clinical examinations uh, which would be of much help in your pre-final and final examination. Let's discuss about the pro forma, the books I have used and the other study materials in my upcoming videos. And second year is usually one and a half years in most of the states. So, it is uh, the right time to attend national and international conferences, to do research activities and to uh, apply for ICM or STS. So make the best use of time and gain the most out of it. All the very best.